2023 presidency, PDP rejected article considering Tamboa one another governor at the Yaju. Deji Adeyaju and Abuja based activists on Wednesday hinted on candidates the People Democratic Party PDP stakeholders are considering to field as presidential candidate in 2023. Adeyanju, convener of Consign Nigerians, claim that PDP stakeholders are considering either Governor Aminu Tambawa of Sokoto State or Governor Bala Mohamed of Baoshi State. In a series of twins, the former PDP member claimed that the party's stakeholders are tired of of fielding of fielding article Abubakar as its presidential candidates. The activities claimed that PDP stakeholders are angry with article for alleged abandoning the party in 2015 elections. According to Adeyanju, PDP stakeholders want to present Tambua or Bala Mohammed, both serving governors as presidential candidate and someone from South as VP in 2023. They said everybody is tired of the Dubai man with dollars. Why won't you guys present him? Now, I want to see you guys in opposition for 16 years. Many of them are so painted that the man abandoned their party after the election and relocated to Dubai for two years, but is now back to start campaigning for another ticket. The only way PDP can get real sense is if they spend 16 years in opposition, APC should present an acceptable candidate in 2023. Well, if the uh, the man called Atiko Abubakar, who has been a PDP member, and he has contested before as a president, but he did not win. If at all he has been relocated to Dubai, stay there, and when election is coming again, he is preparing to take ticket. What is the offenses there? Are this is the PDP stakeholder saying that because he has not been with them, or because he has not been participating? since 2015 does that means that it should be kicked out so i want uh, the pdp stakeholders to consider what they are doing so that it will not backfire them in future i don't know I, it's supposed to be that the pdp stakeholders or pdp members as the as the name uh, as the name entailed should have known what politics is all about i think pdp should have known the, the the past of the politics the present of the politics and the future of the politics because they should not do something in which they will regret tomorrow so those two people that they want to bring in are still the northerners if today they win and become a elected president i tell you they are not they are they will do no difference from what the present administration is doing because these are all not on us we believe that they have the same character although article 2 is not on a but we are talking about somebody who has been with you for a long time who should know his character but those two people they mentioned they are just governor you don't know their character of presidency now the reason i say you don't know their character is this 
when Buhari was campaigning, people were saying, ah, he is the man. He's a good man. He has no fault. He has done well. You know, in his record, he has no bad record. Let us vote for him. People were saying all sorts of things that time. Now, they voted for him when he came in. Look at what he's doing to Nigerians. So, that is why we are saying that you don't even, I mean, compare the person that you have not known. Somebody you, you have not seen, you know, we are not talking about governor right now. Governor is another phase of politics entirely. But when it comes to presidency, my brother, it's a very big thing. Because so many people will fail in that area. As you have so many things to attend to. So, again, I don't know if the period that Atiko stay in Dubai, he has not been getting in touch with them, or he has gone away from them, or he has rejected them. I don't know. But I did not see any reason why the PDP stakeholder should reject him and consider another person. So, they should sit down and then calculate what they are doing very well so that it will not backfire them in time to come. Now, we are considering PDP that they are going to select somebody from the South South or Southeast to become the president. This is what the Nigerians are hoping. But now we are hearing another thing. But they should think well, calculate well, how the future is going to be because the one they have put us for these eight years it do, things does not all go well with nigeria not to come and put other people again that we don't know their character we know their character as governors we have seen them we have seen their acting but governor is a different thing entirely from presidency so i at this time i want to encourage pdp that they should sit down, rethink of what they are doing so that it will not backfire them. Because today, a lot of Nigerians are regretting why they voted for President Mohamed Buhari because they never thought it is coming to do such a thing. So, better rethink so that we not make mistake. So, again, we want to say here that somebody you know is different from somebody you don't know at all. At least the Nigerians have known the character of uh, of Atiko Abubakar. We have seen what he has done. We have known him, and uh, and we have seen his action. So those people they are talking about, we have not seen them. Although the people in their state can really talk about what they have done, but this time we want to know whether. Atiko Abubakar has rejected them before. Maybe that is why they have rejected him. We don't know.